in search of secrets before I get started with today's video. Give this video a thumbs up, hit the subscribe button. I really, really appreciate it. I post every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday about kind of fashion type related videos. So if that interests you, go ahead and subscribe so you never miss one of my uploads. And today we're going to be reviewing Dagny Dover, like a little quick review and my thoughts and my opinions on some of their op products because I have four items from Dagny Dover that I have and I just want to give my kind of two cents on the Dagny Dover brand. This, um, Dagny Dover backpack and this is the Dagny um I believe this is the um classic kind of signature kind of Dagny backpack this one's in the size medium and the color onyx so I guess Dagny doesn't call their items black um if it if it is black it's called onyx and um as you can see like I've had this for a year and a half I use this consistently I've used this for so many different things so many different like you could imagine like I've gym I've taken this to you know flights I've taken this to, you know, international. I've taken this, you know, just to put my laptop and go to Starbucks and, you know, just work on some work. I've taken this to work. I've just done so much just to go shopping on the weekend. Like, I've done so much activity with this backpack that for me, the price of, I believe this is $175. It is, like, absolutely worth it, in my opinion. Like, this backpack right here, it does it all. I will go into a little bit of a detail. So, you have a zipper right here. And in the zipper, we have like a little thing right here. We can kind of put like pens, lip gloss, whatever. Here, I tend to put like my AirPods and you know just my phone just for more easy access. So I'm gonna zip that up. On the side, you have this little kind of stretchy thing. I don't really put anything here. Um, I have a little pocket here which I quite like. Same thing. I don't really put as much in matches here. And same for the other pocket. I'll just put something if it has to be really easy access. But for me, what I like is the sides, especially if you travel a lot. The sides come in so much handy. Like, it is literally, like, the best thing ever. Here, it's, like, literally, you can fit, like, my entire hand in here. You can put, like, a wallet, like, a little card case. You can put your sunglasses. You can put your passport. You can put cash, your phone, AirPods. Everything fits in here. So instead of, like, when I'm walking and I have my backpack on, I don't even, like, have to, like, you know, take it off. I can just literally go right here and just grab what I need to grab. But yes, this literally, the side pocket for myself is what, like, wins it for me. So I have my passport right here. It, like, easily fits in there. And it's, like, a generous kind of space. Here's, like, a card holder, for example. I'll put that in there. Zip that up. Like, that is so perfect and so fun. Like, I just really like this feature, the back pocket. It's a really thought-out bag. Actually, I have the older version, the newer version. You can put it through your luggage. Like, it has, like, a little, like, a little, like, kind of, it has a little thingy right here. We can put it through your luggage. I actually kind of want to, like, buy that one, the newer version, because um, I'm doing a lot of traveling. So, I feel like that'd be really cute and more convenient, but um, I'm not too sure quite yet. So, if you open it in the main compartment for me... Oh my god, guys, I have, like, so much stuff in here. I have, like, some Victoria's Secret stuff because, you know, I'm Victoria's Secret obsessed. But here you have, like, a little, um... Right here you can put your laptop right here. I can put my MacBook Pro. Um, it fits in there perfectly, no problems. On the other side right here you have little two zippers. And here I tend to put, like, little chargers or, um, like, lip glosses or, like, you know, stuff that's super easy access. I can put all of that stuff in here. And then there's another bottom pocket here. And here I tend to put like my MacBook charger because it takes the most amount of space and I don't want it to like, you know, float around. So I can literally put that in there nice and easy. And then you have like a nice kind of generous amount of space. And then right here on the inside, I don't know if you can kind of see, but there's like a little pocket. And here's here on the inside is when I tend to put my water bottle. I know it's for over a year and a half. And the only really wear is this. I don't know how I got this. Um, I really don't know. But other than that, like, this bag literally looks brand new. Um, I love this bag so much. I love the neoprene. It protects the items inside of here. On my MacBook Pro, I don't put, like, any protection. It doesn't have a case or anything. So, I literally just throw around my backpack. I put it in my trunk of my car when, and literally, it is the nicest backpack. It is so luxurious for me, like... I have other bags, I have Balenciaga bags, like, I have, you know, Burberry bags, I have, you know, Chanel bags, Do you, like, my Dior book tote that's right here, that are, you know, thousands of dollars, and for me, I love to carry this for my laptop, I love to, this is, like, absolutely, like, I'm not gonna sit here and lie, you guys, this is absolutely my top three favorite bags that I own in general, out of all my nicer bags, 
or everything this is like definitely going to be in the top three i just love this bag so much and it does so, it fits a lot and i can really dress this backpack up because it's not like nylon where nylon looks more kind of travelly this is neoprene it looks a little bit more sleek a little bit more edgy that's kind of my style so the way i tend to style this like if i'm going to work for example i'll you know my typical outfit is usually like a plain shirt like a plain white tee a plain black tee or like a turtleneck or like a crisp like you know button down shirt I will put a blazer over it and then I tend to wear slacks or um, dark denim and then you know I'll put in like you know a designer shoe you are looking for a great backpack honestly this is right here and I honestly cannot say um, no bad things about it I've tried other kind of competitors of kind of like nylon -y type bags or neoprene kind of you know out and about bags and nothing comes close to this Dagny Dover I am like obsessed with it and um, I've recommended so many people. A lot of my friends have this, a lot of my family members have this backpack. I actually, actually recently bought the diaper backpack for one of my friends that's pregnant as a little baby shower gift. So yes guys, this is for the win and it also comes with like a shoe dust bag. It comes with like a little other wristlet. I don't tend to use those, it's not, it's just like what it is, it is what it is, it's a nice bonus but I don't really use them but this backpack absolutely worth the $175 you will not regret it and if some way somehow you can get it on a discount um, it's worth it for me I don't justify a lot of stuff full price a lot of stuff you see in the background I get it on sale but for me like if I were to lose this again I will literally go and buy this full price no problem worth the money for me every single penny this backpack's worth it other item that I have right here is a little toiletry bag um, I got this like a couple months ago um, this is kind of like my little travel kit where I put like all the stuff that I use for travel so here I still have, I, it's kind of funny I still have the case for it but it's like my little kind of you know international kind of cue so I always have chargers like anywhere where I go I have like this little Victoria's Secret little lingerie bag like my to go kind of um little moisturizer which is charlotte tilbury and i also have a um, concealer from nars like i just kind of put like the stuff that i use for travel and so it kind of all goes in here the only thing i'm missing in here is a lint roller but for me i love this so much it fits like my toothbrush my toothpaste like this is the only kind of toiletry type bag that i put in and for me i just love it i love that it's a very uniform the luggage that i use when i travel is my remova luggage um it's matte black on black and like all the Dagny stuff is super uniform to that. That's why I like it. And yeah, so I do really like this one a lot. You can make it a lot bigger. And all the items come with dust bags, which is something that I also really appreciate with. But this is such a nice item. The other item that I have is this Dagny fanny pack. Um, same thing. I love this so much. Um, I want you to picture me the last time I wore it. I was wearing um, a Hugo Boss blazer. I was wearing a... I believe a gray turtleneck. I was wearing my Hermes belt. I was wearing a pair of trousers and I think my beige sneakers. And it just looks so polished, so very sleek and very nice. For me, I love to put my little credit card in here, just in and out. It fit my phone. It, it literally fits everything I could possibly need inside of here. And it just think it's just like such a nice everyday bag like look i have so like i use this bag a lot like i have so much receipts in here i probably have to go through them but for me i just i love the fanny pack and i just really like the neoprene in general i know some people like the color um dagny stuff for me i'm kind of basic so black works perfectly fine and it never gets dirty you never have to worry about anything so i really do like this fanny pack and like i said i tend to wear it more across my chest than more as a fanny pack we can use that as both. This is a great hiking bag, going, you know, shopping in the city, tra traveling in the city. It's just like a nice and all your stuff is here to make sure like nobody steals or nothing from you. And this is just like a really great secure bag that I love to have. It's a nice high quality item, but without an expensive price tag, in my opinion, I think the Dagny stuff is honestly really well priced. And if, honestly, if they if they charge more, like if that backpack one day, Dagny decided to charge me $300, $400, honestly, no joke. Like there's certain things that like i said there's a lot of things that i will never pay full price for like i said i get a lot of designer items i get a lot of good deals but dagny dover is a brand that i'm willing to pay the full price it for me it's worth it 100 percent cannot say nothing negative about dagny dover i also have this one right here this one is kind of like the kind of catch-all i have the older version as well um the one that doesn't have a little sleeve on it but same thing is a good travel i put it on top of my remote uh, suitcase and it just looks super sleek super polished um i don't really use this one much as a gym bag um 
I use this one more when I travel and more when I'm kind of sleeping the night or just kind of, you know, I have to run, like if I have to run a lot of, lot of errands and let's say um, the other day I had to do like a lot of Victoria's Secret price adjustments, I, or like, I put all my stuff in here and so like it fits everything in a super uniform and I don't have to waste like a plastic bag or I don't have to bring like other things, everything fits in here. Or if I'm doing even grocery shopping, like I've even brought this to going grocery shopping and if I'm just buying like a few things like at Target, I'll just throw them in here and keep it moving. So this one fits quite a lot and this one's the smaller one. I know there's like an XX, there's like three sizes. There's like a baby one, this size, and then a bigger and then like a big, big, big one. And for me, I think this one's the perfect, um, this is the perfect one for me. I'm kind of around six foot, just for reference, but I really like this one. Not as much as the backpack, as I am quite a true backpack person. But yeah, guys, I'm really happy and I'm really satisfied with all the items that I have from Dagny Dover. I plan to purchase maybe a, even like a wallet, a little card case from them. Um, I have like that YSO card holder that you saw. I have like um, a couple other ones from different brands and I really want it to be all uniform, so I think I may buy the Dagny Dover card case but for me Dagny Dover is a win I don't approve a lot of things I'm very picky when it comes to my items uh, very very picky and for me uh, Dagny is everything that I could possibly want something that wears nice it's a good price um, it's durable it lasts long it doesn't look dated it's just it has everything that I'm looking for and that's why like I really love and I appreciate all these items and um, when people ask me is Dagny Dover worth the price tag yes Period. They can even charge more, and I'm with me as a consumer. I'm willing to pay more for it. But yeah, guys, thank you so much for watching my little Dagny Dover review. I can know I know I kind of went a little bit off topic here and there, but for me, I'm just really passionate about Dagny Dover. It's a really great brand. And yeah, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I'll post every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday on this YouTube channel. And I really appreciate you can hit the subscribe button and let me know your thoughts and comments about Dagny Dover. Have you heard about Dagny Dover? Have you not? Do you have some of the items? Do you like some of the items? I'd love to hear it down below. And yeah, guys, just thank you so much for watching this video. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye, guys.